<laughs> I know you love your pets. I love my pets too. The, you know, the, the human animal bond is a, is a very real thing. And clearly we all, we all want what's best for them. We all want them to live long, uh, happy and healthy lives. Uh, and that's why I wrote the Ultimate Pet Health Guide about how they can take better care of their pets outside of what, what they may already know. Because one of the things that I, that I really want pet owners to know is that the one thing that they can do to really make a difference in their pets' lives is, is to improve their lives through nutrition. You're, you're buying the expensive bag of kibble or the expensive cans or, or even possibly what was, was recommended by your veterinarian. Uh, we know uh, for our own bodies that, that eating highly processed food is not good for us. The closer that we get as people to eating a fresh whole food diet, the healthier we are likely to be. No matter how good the ingredients were that went in at the beginning, by the time they get to the other end of the line and they're in the bag or the can, that is by definition highly processed food. And regardless of, of, of you know, the, the marketing buzzwords that may be out there in the advertising or on the bag about grain-free and fresh ingredients and all, all this sort of thing, um, the highly processed nature of these foods are creating problems in our pets. You know, so there's no real difference between us eating those foods and our pets eating those foods, except for one really important thing, that when, when you and I go out and eat the wrong thing, you know, eat the wrong meal, you know, that's, that's one meal. And then you can go back and you go back to eating a reasonably healthy diet. When, when you're feeding your pet dry, you know, dry kibble or canned food, that's every meal every day for their entire life. There is no way that that is not adding up to trouble, um, either you know sooner or later. That is going to cause problems.